Good morning, one and all. Moving ahead with our chapter, chapter number twelve, that is time. And in this session, we are going to learn about leap year, right? Now we are very familiar about the number of days in February. Most probably, we are familiar about twenty-eight days or jaise jaise February na, right? Ne? But after some year, there are twenty-nine days in February. कोई बार फेब्रुअरी में 29 डेज भी आवे तो ये किधर चेक द इयर्स इन विच फेब्रुअरी हैज 29 डेज आर कॉल अ लीप ईयर राइट એટલે જ્યારે ભી કોઈ ઈયર માં જો ફેબ્રુઆરી માં 29 ડેજ આવે તો ધેટ ઈયર ઇઝ કન્સિડર એઝ અ લીપ ઈયર સમજ પડે છે देयर આર 366 ડેજ ઇન અ લીપ ઈયર Right. If we talk about a normal year, then there are 365 days in a normal year. But if we consider leap year, the one day increases, and the total number of days will be 366 days. But but, so much for that. Okay. So leap year, the February month has 29 days. So for a leap year, there are 366 days. Now to check whether the given year is a leap or not, we divide the numeral for the year by four. Every time to check whether the given year is leap year or not, we have to divide by four. The reason is the leap year comes every four years. Four years per chit average, right? For example, 2000. It is a leap year. Then the second leap year will be after four years, means 2004. So much better check it. The four four years no gap are which check one hour check leap year is not which check. If the remainder is zero, then the year is leap year. Otherwise, it is not. Right? जो remainder zero के जाए, for what we can say that we can say that the that year. The leap year. If it is not, then it is not a leap year. So let's see. Check whether the following years are leap years or not. So first one. Year two thousand and eight. Let's see whether two thousand eight is leap year or not. So dividing to check whether it is leap year or not. Not what we have to do. Dividing. What we are going to divide? Eight thousand and two thousand and eight by four. Right? To check whether the given year is leap year or not. What we have to do? We have to divide that year by four. So here which year is that? Two thousand eight. So that two thousand eight we are going to divide by four. Chal, let's divide. So, two thousand eight divided by four. Four fives are twenty. How many remains? Zero, zero. Bring down zero. Whenever we bring one digit ahead, we have to divide that also. So, four zeros are zero. How many remains? Zero minus zero, zero. Bring down eight. So, four. Two is a zero. Now here you can see that remainder is zero. Here what we can say that remainder is zero. Therefore, two thousand eight is leap year. Two thousand eight के वो तो leap year तो means what in the year two thousand eight. February contains 29 days. So much for that, sir. Right? Sure. Let's see another example. Second one. Year 2010. Let's check whether 2010 is a leap year or not. So what we are going to do? Divide it. 2010 by 4. Let's divide. 
how to write time using am and pm i have already written the full form of am that is ante meridian and pm that is post meridian right acha so let's see the point the first one we are very familiar about the point a day has 24 hours we are very familiar that a day contains 24 hours a clock shows the time twice each day each and every day the clock shows times in two manner right jo badale dhyan thi khabar hase right to aavi rite clock aapko represent thai chhe 